What's up, party people? It is Brian here with Unrivaled Multimedia. I am still in awe and shock at Tyron Woodley becoming the new UFC welterweight champion after putting Robbie Lawler to sleep by KO in the first round. Who saw that coming? Nobody. Not me, not you, nobody. Came in, fainted with the right, hit the jab with the left. Robbie Lawler was asleep in air. Mid-air, he was asleep before his head hit the ground. Then, puts him against the cage while he's asleep. Rams him in with this brutal jabs. Mergliata should have stopped the fight when he was in mid-air, put to sleep by Tyron Woodley. That was was a mind-blowing KO. Don't remember the last time. Somebody like Robbie Lawler was destroyed so easily because nobody out there saw Robbie Lawler losing the way he did. Maybe Woodley would take him down, win by points or a ground and pound, but he beat Robbie Lawler at his own game. Robbie Lawler is known as a lethal striker who puts guys away. And Woodley just beat him at his signature. Which is, like I said, putting guys away. We know Woodley in the past has been called a choker by Dana White. That is definitely no longer the case. He had been out over 500 days since his last fight. Almost a year and a half. And during that year and a half, it is obvious that Woodley worked on his mental game. Because in big fights in the past, he has come up short. I don't think he was a choker like Dana White said. But this guy is the real deal. And he proved it tonight by becoming the welterweight champion. He has been around for a long time. If you watch Strike Force, he was in a big fight with Nate Marquardt for the U.S., the actually strike force welterweight title and came up short. This guy was in a big fight with Rory McDonald one time for a title shot. So kudos to Tyron Woodley, who has been climbing that mountain for a while and is finally there. And for Robbie Lawler, wow, what do you do after that? That was a Mack truck hitting him. And I just am blown away by this and want to know your guys opinions on this major upset of Tyron Woodley beating Robbie Lawler so I am definitely looking forward to hearing from Tyron Woodley in the next few days and also seeing if he will fight Stephen Thompson next because that will be a barn burner of a fight with those two styles so like I said kudos to Tyron Woodley and really look forward to seeing him fight again so with that being said, please give this video a thumbs up, share this video, and please do subscribe to Unrivaled Multimedia. And until next time, take it easy.